Okay, it's about 3 o'clock and I'm at the end of my painting session for today, Tuesday, July 4th. And thank goodness because it's been a long day. I painted from about 10.30 to uh, 3 o'clock and that's enough for me. I get very tired towards the end of the session. So, Anyway, um, what I did today was I am hopefully I'm working on being able to show a close-up here. I hope that works. Um, I'm also going to show a still picture when I do my blog entry, but anyway, so what I did today, uh, I had the drawing on the canvas already, so that's good. That saved me some time from yesterday, and I started in with the, the sky and the back building, and generally speaking, I worked my way from the back of the canvas to the front, so from the back of the picture to the front. Uh, I generally start with the sky, that uh, helps me to set the tone for the piece. Uh, I usually end up adjusting the sky, making it lighter or sunnier or what have you, adding clouds, that kind of thing. But for the moment, I, uh, I think I want the sky to be this blue color, maybe a little bit darker than the lights that I'm going to put on the building. I think that will help the building to stand out. Uh, this building right here is going to be a pale, pale yellow color. It's almost a white. And I think if the sky is a little bit darker than that, um, and this building is darker, it's back here in the shade, I think that'll really help this building to come forward. So we'll see. Uh, I won't know until I get into it, obviously. And then, you know, at the end of the painting, I reserve the right to adjust things so that they make sense to me. So anyway, that's my plan. So to begin with, uh, I don't know about this canvas because I had a hell of a time getting the paint onto it to begin with and then getting the paint to stick. I don't know what the issue is. These are my canvases from Dick Blick. This is like their premiere line. I don't know about it being premiere because I just had a really difficult time getting the paint on there. So what I ended up doing was simply painting this entire building, you know, just this golden brown color and then going in and adding the windows and the details and everything like that. So it was just tough. I don't know if it's because I added an extra layer of gesso to the canvas. Um, I don't know if it's just a crummy canvas. I don't know if my brushes suck. Uh, I have no idea. But it's, it's a different experience than what I've had so far to date. And the only thing I can think of is that the Dick Blick canvas is not so good. So. Anyway, I just had a really tough time getting the paint on there. Um, that makes it hard to hard to keep going, but you know, in for a dime, in for a dollar. So that was the one thing. And then um, the other thing that I had a hard time with, of course, were these windows. And I ended up, if I can show this, I ended up with this shape right here at the top. I used a nickel, you know, like a, a coin, a nickel, I put the nickel here and I drew a little line and I painted underneath the line. It worked out really well. So I'm happy with that. Um, it's going to be crucial right here where this building meets that building. There is just a little sliver of street and walkway and it's in the light so it's going to be important to show that so these buildings don't look like they're totally fused together. So um, I'm anxious about that. I'm going to get the street installed. So my plan tomorrow is to finish up this building here. Um, there's a, uh, a walkway here and a railing that needs to be done. That will help. And then to install this back street and then to install this front street because this building kind of, in essence, sits on the sidewalk and the street and this back building. So as I said, I work from the back of the canvas forward and um, this building will be the last thing that I do. So. That is it for today, and uh, I'll let you know what happens tomorrow.